He starts with a basic idea, then fills the canvas as different thoughts pop into his head. In this case, using his pencil and paintbrush to depict the effects of an ongoing doctor's strike in Kenya. Let me say I'm just creating awareness. I'm not favoring any side, but uh, I'm just neutral. But uh, I take my uh, art. You know, art is a very powerful tool. I'm taking it as a tool to facilitate to the ongoing strike so that people can know their positions and then they can be able to come together faster and solve the issue. And so Kenyan artist Joseph Mbatia, better known as Bertiers, has started working on a new piece that depicts his interpretation of the strike, not the first time he's worked on this theme. In 2014, Ebola hit West Africa and many were concerned it might move east. So Bertiers imagined a doctor's strike coinciding with an Ebola outbreak in Kenya. I had planned that, uh, to do that because I had some rumors that doctors were going to strike. And in fact, they did it. The strike happened. Ebola did not. And Bertiers showcased this piece at an East African art auction in 2015, one of the many politically and culturally motivated works he has created here at his studio on the outskirts of Nairobi. He says there's a reason for the many sardonic details that characterize his style. With me, when I, when I draw it like that, it gives more impact to people out there to see that uh, the matter is becoming even more serious. When you go to the hospital and find that uh, there are some dead people in the bed and the others who are coming to, to see their loved, their loved ones, whether they are being given drugs, uh, it, is, it is really not too good. And as he continues to work in his studio, Bertier says he hopes the doctors will soon go back to work as well. Jill Craig, VOA News, Nairobi.